most of the women there, or at least some of the women, uh, I get into prison because of petty crimes, out of poverty, things that, you know, can be easily forgiven or solved, rather, yes. if something is done to them. But what of other serious cases, like murder? Have you encountered women who have you know, gotten into prison out of murder and from a background of gender-based violence? Um, we have, yes, we have, we have clients who have been in prison because of murder. Mm -hmm. And one of the approaches that we take when we meet the women in prison, because our first contact with the women is in prison, is not for us to ask, what did you do? we allow the story to, to evolve naturally mm -hmm. because we don't want to look like we are supporting you because you did a petty crime and we are not supporting you because you did a major crime. crime, you know. All of them are crimes and I think the important thing is to be able to support them through the journey to reintegrate. So we have them and currently we actually have um, uh, two uh, people, a man and a woman in Kericho prison. Um, one killed, uh, the woman killed the husband because of, of uh, infidelity issues and they're in prison. The, the other one, uh, the, 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 the woman killed, the man killed the wife because mm -hmm. of infidelity issues. And so uh, we, uh, where that started is, you know, the uh, violence, you know, it could be verbal, it could be emotional, it could be, you know, um, physical, it could be uh, a sexual, you know, and in the end, you know, it gets to the extreme of having the, you know, the, 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 the people, the partners kill each other, you know, and the, 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 they, they get, they end into prison, yes.